Namaste. I am Dr. Nischal, practicing as a consultant dermatologist at Nirmal Skin and Hair Clinic, Vijayanagar, Bengaluru. Skin warts. Lot of time, there is a confusion with regard to skin warts. Sometimes people think a skin tag is a wart. Sometimes people think wart is a tag. So what exactly it is? There are two things. Both warts as well as skin tags are small um, skin growths which happen on the skin. Both of them are actually not symptomatic. Means they don't give you any pain, itching, burning, nothing is there except that you see some growths on the skin. How do we commonly differentiate? The growths which are skin colored, which are soft, which are smooth, commonly happening in the root of the neck, underarms are usually skin tags. They are technically called as acropardons. Whereas wards are also skin colored, they are fleshy, sometimes they are flat and they are smooth. That's called as veruca plana or a flat wart or sometimes they are digitating. They are like your fingers projecting like this. That's called as a digitate wart or it can be single projection which is called as a filiform wart. So wards usually either they are flat surfaced okay they are just like a plate which is kept on the skin or it can be projecting like a cauliflower or like a finger like projection so that is how we differentiate a skin tag from a wart what is the implication of both see if it is a skin tag it is just a genetically driven condition so you treat it and it is gone but only thing is it can come back because it's your genetic thing it's in your genes so it can always come back not there. But do you need to fear for that? No, because skin tag will never become a cancer. Second thing is why do we need to treat a wart? We need to treat wart because it's an infection. It's caused by human papilloma virus. So this infection can spread within one body part to other body part or it can spread from a person to person. For that reason, we need to treat. How do we treat both of them? So it is by simple ablation. You destroy them. So it's called as radio frequency ablation or we can do a laser ablation. Wards can also be removed by freezing it. That's called as a cryotherapy. In either of these ways, we can remove the skin tag or a wart. Only thing is the wart, it's an infection and the body has to fight for it. Unless the body fights for it, warts can happen again and again. Whereas skin tags are genetic, anyways it will come. Commonly people get it removed every three to four years once, and it's a simple technique by how we remove either of these things. So be it a skin tag or a skin wart, nothing to fear. It's a one time procedure. It's simple without any major side effects. You can safely consult your dermatologist to get rid of them. Thank you.